This is Die Sporting Network. What, what? Welcome you back here to the CCBC Catonville Conley Wellness Center for our second matchup of the IAABO Board 23 Challenge in its first year. In our second matchup, we have North Carolina Bulldogs at a record of 0-1. They lost to Crisfield down near the eastern shore. And up against C. Milton Wright out of Hartford County, UCBA, C. Chesapeake Division. And a record of 1-0. They beat Kenwood on Friday night. So it almost looked like Duke and North Carolina, but it's not. C. Milton Wright is in the white home jerseys. And the tip-off goes to the 2A finalist, North Carolina. Leonard Fret Patrick, the sophomore, with the basketball to start. Lost eye, A.J. Alexander Johnson with you, and that's an early two from the Bulldogs. Richard, and that two goes in for them. North Carolina made it to Xfinity Center last season. Fell to Lake Clifton in the two-way final. And they're trying to rebound this year. Team that still has a bit of juniors on it. They only have three seniors, however. Final bond, number three, is the freshman Dodd. He'll be starting for him in the Dodd jersey. C. Milton Wright. And that one misses inside. That one didn't go. The rebound back over to Fitchett. Pass it back over. That's a three from Bonds. That one tipped and missed. Offensive rebound briefly. And then it was snatched away by Sinski, the junior. Ball flies out of bounds. Singler wasn't able to get it. And it's going to go back to North Carolina. C. Milton Wright from Hartford County. We've seen them in the Tunnel Vision Fall League. Getting their team going. They are right now, they are ranked in the top 20 in the Fossey Sports Nets poll here in this early season. That's a drive inside. Kicks it back. Oh, that's a three from the top of the key. That one back on misses from Haunton. Balls everywhere. Nisky able to keep it for the Mustangs. Back over. Swings it over to Haunton. Shot clock at 13. That's a three in the corner. That one tipped and missed. Offensive rebound. Hook shot didn't go. The rebound grabbed over by Corey Hall. Curly. Curler, excuse me, the sophomore. Got that curly hair. Should be uh, interesting there for North County. North Carolina, excuse me. Travel. And the ball back over to uh, the Mustangs. Osinski brings it up, kicks it over. That's a three. That one tipped and missed. Tried to save it and do, and the Mustangs will keep it on their end. Haunting from the top of the key for three, and it goes. Three to two game. Passed it, turned it over. Haunting. Swing pass. Lays it in off the glass. A nice one two combination there as Jackson was able to finish. 5 2 game. North Carolina will keep it. See him right in the class 3A. North Carolina and, of course, 2A, as we mentioned 
early in our telecounts. That's a three. That one missed the side of the rim there from Fr Fridget. And back over. Oh, Sensky blocked by Curler and a foul. Ryan Simsky at the line, shooting two. First shot in front of miss. Hatfield in the game, number 34. Second shot, that backed in two. Curler with the rebound. Vigette with it, brings it up. North Carolina put the first two up, but they have uh, went down five, two cents. Inside, and that one didn't go. Haunton with the rebound. Up the court, swing pass there from the Jackson. Pulls up, spins out. And the rebound over to Wayman. Fetch it with it, passed it over, curler. Inside, swings it back. And he got it taken away from him. Stymie all the way and lays it up for two. 7-2 game early. And C. Milton Wright from Harford County looking good so far in this one. Back to game action, and uh, so far, the C. Milton Wright, the Mustangs, looking good in uh, North Carolina in his early season still, trying to find themselves. And the Shields, the junior, had it. Swings it up the court there to Wayman. Kicks. Inside, off the glass, missed. And the ball on the deck, finally hate Hatfield with it. Swings it over to Stamsky. Back over to Jackson. Jackson doubled. Inside, and he's shooting two. Stamsky again getting to the free throw line. Two shot foul here coming up. Langski. Didn't get the first. Had like a lid on a basket. Second shot did not go. Up the court here. Drive inside, no. And the offensive rebound back over. That one goes a three. Very nice. The Shields driving it from downtown right now. Balls thrown in the air. Haunton finally gets it back here for C. Milton Wright. Nice key back over. Hatfield. And a travel. Traveling call. Patterson was looking to drive to the hoop, but not quite. Swings it. That's a three. That one tipped and missed. Haunton gets the rebound. 223 here left in the first. 
Hunton pulls back. That's a three. Onions hits him. Dylan Kutcher. 10-5 game. See Milton Wright looking to use the long bomb in this one. Frank's it. Double teamed. Almost picked off. It's going to stay with North Carolina, but that was definitely a good hustle there. No doubt about it. Fakes it inside the floater. The Shells couldn't finish it. Ball off the knee. Nice save there by Haunton. Kutcher was able to get it and brings it up now for the Mustangs. Haunton swings it back over. Kutcher for three. Spend out that time on him. North Carolina get it back. 133 left. Turned it over though. Kutcher inside. Stamsky off the glass and in. Oh, that one. 12 5 game. See Milton Wright. Been in control of this one. On the jump. Vijay swings it over. Inside. Corey Hall had it. Back over that shot goes in for Vijay. 12 7 game here. Swings it over. Doubled, fakes it, puts it in, puts it over. Oh, it gave it right to him, a turnover. Blocked back, nice by Haunted all alone. Off the glass and then he puts it home. How about Haunted doing a little bit of everything here in the first quarter, especially in the hustle stats. Shot clock and clock is a second apart. Behind the back pass, missed it over the handle. And C. Milton Wright looking to increase the lead here. Haunton, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. Contra, back over to Haunton, swings it, Stymie. Inside the big man, ah, didn't get it in. And that's going to be the end of the quarter if Richard tried to throw it up. So after one, the score is doubled, and C. Milton Wright. Has looked good here from Harford County action. 14 7 game over the Eastern Shores, North Carolina. And uh, as we come back at you, second quarter about to get going here in a moment. See what C. Milton Wright can keep this lead. And so far, their senior guard, number two, Quincy Haunton, is looking good here. In this one, and uh, North Carolina trying to get things back going for them as well. And their team, depending right now, well, number 10, Leroy Fitcher, has taken a lot of the shots for the, the two way finalists, Bulldog team. And uh, we'll see what the second quarter has in store here for us. And we'll get you back to game action. At this time. So second quarter. Is underway. That's about to be underway, excuse me, as uh, Jordan Stimey gives it up to Hunt. Pass it over. Jackson. Oh, layup is good. What a play that was there. Nice play. How about Bray Hopkins there getting a two? And this is 16 7 game. Inside off the class. And then how about Wayman putting the two in there? Yeah, keeping Sounds right in it. Haunting now. Batted away. Martin still not letting them turn over. Swings it back over. That's a three. Oh, yeah. Quincy Haunton 
And a 10 point lead now for the Mustangs of C. Milton Wright. Passed it over there. The Shields. Fidget. Almost turned it over. Swings it, kicks it back over. Swings inside, not able to elevate high. Fast break here. Swings it back over. Haunting from downtown. That one tipped and missed that time. Tried to save it, no good. And the ball back to the Bulldogs. Bulldogs lost on 21 to Cecil Field on Thursday, 58-37. Trying to rebound today. That drive up. Doubled. Jump ball. And the ball looked like it will stay with North Carolina. 6.20 here left in the first half. Interesting one here, to say the least. Mervo and Calvert Hall coming up after this one. Inside and a walk. So Hall got right into the baseline area and was frozen up and them feet moved at the same time. And as you see, he probably him. Haunting again. Young fella for three. Oh, baby. Nailed that one. Jordan Semsky for three. 21 9. Right now, C. Milton Wright is controlling the pace of this game. And they are really setting up well, shooting well in the half court. Swings it over. Dish Shields. Side. Nice sandwich. Contested shot. And again, Haunton gets his hands in there. Inside to Johnson. Layup is good. 23 to 9. To my apologies, 22 to 9. They had a scoring malfunction with the uh, scoreboard. A foul is called. We have not heard the whistle blow often. And that's only the uh, second team foul for uh, C. Milton Wright. So the inbounds. No free trying to get it going. Trying to actually get with the scoreboard, and they do. They finally get that right, and we are back to game action here. Passed it over inside Hall. Reverso, how about that? Got it in. 24-11 game here. Okay, I'm trying not to let this one get out of hand too much. Batted in the air. Finally over Jordan Sasky. Got it now. Little Bob the big brother. Oh, look out. Got to shoot it. Will it get it off in time? No. And the rebound back over to North Carolina. What a, that, that was. Bonds had it briefly. 
Inside, pull up, no good. Battle in the air. Rebound over. Swings it. Jordan Stymie for three. That one's it's off the rim. Fast break the other way. Barnes. And a push off. And a good call by the ref there. Ball back over to C. Milton Wright. Johnson. Bullis back over. That's a three. And Stymie front end shorted there. Byron Stymie, that is. Kicks it. Out of bounds. Ball's going to stay with North Carolina. David Ross looking to come in. Inside the hook shot off the glass and in. That was a nice one there by Mr. Hall. Casaliti 11 now. Back inside, trying to return the favor. And coming up to shoot two. Hunter, Hunter Singler shooting a pair. 3.07 here left in the half. First shot goes. Second shot here. That one goes too. 26-13 game. Again, the lead has been doubled. Swings it over. And now it's turned now it's turned over. Fast break the other way. Drive to the hoop. Missed it high off the glass. Offensive rebound to Brian Simsky. He's coming up to shoot two now. Brian Simsky coming up to shoot a pair. Right now. The tempo and everything is looking in the C. Milton's right direction. They are looking real good. Trying to get their record to 2-0 on the season. Second shot didn't go. So... A little empty trip at the line. Back over, Hall inside. Got it in there. Nice positioning by him. And then the lead's down to 11. Jumper. That one hits off the back of the arm. North Carolina can cut it to single digits again. Bond fakes it. Oh, man. Foul against C. Milton Wright. ML back over to Curler. Swinging it now. Bonds. The Shields. And the Curler. That's a three. Hits it. Nice one there by the Shields. 
We got an eight-point game. Back. Front end miss. Offensive rebound. Pass it. Jackson. Over to Brian Sarsky. Back inside. Nice pass work. Three didn't go. Offensive rebound. Count the basket and one. There for Hunter Singler. First shot. That's the end. One shot, no good. But the offensive rebound is good off the class. Miss. We got a foul against the Mustangs. So the ball will go back to the Bulldogs. 96 seconds. That's excuse me, 94 seconds here left in the first half. And a game that has been played at uh, the Mustangs' tempo. Setting up that offense, half court, and able to execute. Drive inside, balls on the deck, and then it was snatched back up. North Carolina caught a break, but then it was turned over. Haunting, using his size as a 6 3 guard, has really been effective. That's a three, that one front end miss, offensive rebound, back out to Haunting, and he holds. We are down to seconds here left. Haunton gets it back again. Swings it inside. Lost the handle. And a foul against Haunton. 15 foul against C. Milton Wright. Both teams have five fouls each, so two more will put the one on one in effect. We might not have enough time to see that, though, however. You never know, but I don't think we have enough time to see it here in the first half of the Swings it. Back over. And that's a foul. 16 foul. So I could be corrected if there's one more. Swings it back. That's a three. That one didn't go. Shot clock is off. 18 seconds left is Haunton. Swings it up. Swings it up. Travel. As you know, stopped out. It was on the line. 13.8 left. And North Carolina can cut this baby into single digits going in a half. Ten. Nine. And the ball's turned over out of bounds. So now C. Milton Wright can get a chance to increase their 10 point lead. Going in a half. Seven, six, five, four, three. Haunting all the way to the basket. Offensive foul. And the ball going, and they wouldn't have counted. But it is winning and out. 2.7, quick catch and shoot. Depends where you're catching and shooting. Two, one, throws it up. And right out of bounds near the cameraman. So it's halftime. It's a 10 point lead here for C. Milton Wright over North Carolina. We'll be back with the second half here on the Dice Way Network. Coming up at you. You stay tuned. Second half. About to get on the way here. The Mars die. And Alexander Johnson, AJ here with you. And uh, what a matchup. Ten point lead uh, for C. Milton Wright against North Carolina. C. Milton Wright trying to go to 2 0 here on the season. 
As they say, so far, so good. As Johnson up to Haunton. And a foul. All with the foul against Brian Sagsky. Swings it back over. Fakes, shoots, front end miss. Offensive rebound. And coming up to shoot two. First shot. Hopkins missed the first. Second shot, front end miss. Back down the court. That's a three. Oh, that's a hit one. Haunting. Inside. That one drops. The lead increasing. 30 to 18 now for the Mustangs. See Milton Wright. We get another Mustang, Mervo. That'll be coming up. Drive inside. Nice pass work in off the glass. A miss. Foul. By Hall there. So Haunton brings it up. Swings it back over to Brian Sainsky. Jackson. Another swing back. That's a three. Oh, look out. Offensive rebound. There by the Mustangs. Bat it. Turned over. Vision and company with it. Curler missed it. Offensive rebound, a foul. Foul against C. Milton Wright. Swings it. Back, no good. Offensive rebound. Didn't go and back over. Here comes Seaman Wright. Inside. Got the run. And a turnover there on the other end by, by North Carolina. Seaman Wright gets it back. Pass it, shoots it back. That's a three. And look like a foul. Ball back to uh, North Carolina. And out of bounds. Swinging it. Vision back over. The Shields got his own tap back. Bad news is shot clock was down. And the ball's everywhere. I think C. Milton Wright will keep it. And that ball was everywhere there. No question about that. The Shields called on the foul. Ethan 
Haunton in a corner for three. Yes, sir. Leads up to 17 now. Swings it back over. Turned it over. Haunton back the other way for the for the Wolver for the Mustangs. Excuse me. That layup is good, and it's a 19-point lead. C. Milton Wright has gained control of this one. Back to game action, and right now, C. Milton Wright looking good. Looking to go to 2-0 and on the young season. And the 2A finalists, North Carolina, trying to find themselves here in this young season. And the pressure on defense has really been an issue for them, as you see now. Right back, the layup is good again. That's a 21-point lead for the Mustangs. The favorite this year in the UCBAC conference and they play in the Chesapeake division end. There's C. Milton Wright. So the Shields inbounds. Back over, the Shields. Swings it, kicks it back over. Turns it over again. Fast break time. Back over, this Kutcher went up high on him. Offensive rebound there to Hatfield. Swings it back over. Haunton, back over to Kutcher. Kutcher back over to Haunton. Eight on the shot clock. Cuts inside. Tried to save it, but no good. A turnover. And uh, North Carolina trying to get it back. The Bulldogs have not scored here in the third quarter so far, and they have really been outscored 11 to nothing here in it. Trying to get some offense going. Trying to get it set up. That's a three. That's front end miss. Tapped out of bounds. Ball going to go back to uh, C. Milton Wright. Back over. Looking for Haunton. Got him now. Back inside. Little Euro step there, no good. That's the ball back over to uh, North Carolina. Doubled and turned over. Nice steal in the passing lane. Three on two, fast break. Cutcher up the court, off the glass and in. Nice one. And the drought continues for the Bulldogs of North Carolina in them dark uniforms there. They have been held. To 18 points. None of them scored here in the second half so far. Inside, off the side of the rim, a temporary block and two shots. Coming up here for Kaywin Wayman, the junior. 2.43 here left in the third.
first shot. Off the arm. Calvert Hall in the house. We will see them. Coming up here on the uh, nice running network up against Mervo. I'm not sure. Second shot goes. First point of the second half here for um, North Carolina. Back over is Harnton. Half field. Swing over to Kutcher. Harnton wide open for three. Spin in and out. Offensive rebound. Count the basket and one. Patterson shooting the and one here. That tipped and missed offensive rebound. Kotcher, and they're going to hold set up here. Haunting, doubled. Hatfield. One time he had it briefly. Inside, Patterson. It tipped out. It went out on him. Almost a triple team. Forced a pass there. And a blocking foul against C. Milton Wright. Barnes trying to drive, and he was preceded there not to. Two minutes left here. No field goals here in the third quarter for North Carolina. It and took it away. Patterson over to Hatfield. Back over to Haunton. Haunton inside. Foul on the floor against North Carolina as uh, Kutcher was driving. And his, uh, he was preceded not able to go inside. Haunton for three. That one tipped and missed. Patterson was trying to grab the rebound, not there. They call a jump ball. Let's see which way to go. I think North Carolina should keep it and they will. So, substitution in. Swings it back over. And almost a turnover, over, not quite inside. Oh, that was a wild shot. Able to get it back. That's a three from Barnes. That one tipped and missed. Patterson's fouled. And Patterson got to be careful. A little frustration there as he well, was preceded. The referees let him know. Let's not do that now. And, uh, Ball back over to C. Milton Wright. 116 left. They have played about as flawless of a third quarter you will see here this year so far in the young season. It's already a seventh team foul, by the way. I didn't even myself notice that on North Carolina. And the fouls have piled up in a rapid hurry. And the one and one is in effect here in this one. Bad enough, see Milton Wright in the lead, in a big lead. Now they had a free throw advantage. First shot goes. Almost a 30 point advantage here. Second shot. Back on, offensive rebound. Briefly, and then back over is North Carolina, but the numbers is not in the favor. Foul is called. Hard there was Brown. He's coming up to shoot two here.
Full lineup substitution coming in here for uh, C. Milton Wright. They're going to get their uh, second string in and get some time in the fourth quarter. First string, first shot, excuse me. That didn't go. Using a game like this, get your first team in, get them to get some work in. Second shot goes. So, one of two. Two points has been scored by North Carolina here in the quarter. Both of them at the line. Still looking to execute back over. Jumper. That one tipped and missed. There by Jackson. Back the other way. Down to seconds, 40 seconds to be precise. And communication wasn't there for that pass. Ball back to, uh, to the Mustangs. 38.1 left here in the third. And this one's been one that's been controlled by C. Milton Wright from the tip. Turned it over there. North Carolina back up. Pull up jumper. That one tipped and missed. Out of bounds. Ball's going to stick and stay with the Bulldogs. Throws it back in. Swings it over. That's a three. Hits it. First field goal of the third quarter. As Fitchett was able to put it. Two, one. That's from downtown. That one's not going to get there. So after three, a game that has been dominated here in the third quarter by C. Milton Wright. They are up 44 to 23, a 21 point lead. Here by five points in the quarter for. North Carolina and North Carolina was not able to score a field goal while the main starters of C. Milton Wright was in. Coming up after this one is Mervo, the Mustangs, trying to get to 2-0 and they was able to beat the City on Wednesday. They take on a Calvary Hall team that is going into their seventh matchup here already at the young season. They was at Mount St. Joe's last evening and uh, did not prevail. They are 2-4. and four. Here in the early season, they have had a lot. Teams go up against Coretti and the like. So we will see Calvert Hall for the first time ourselves this season. Up against Mervo coming up here on the Dice Play Network right after this one. Here between C. Milton Wright and North Carolina. And fourth quarter begins. Fourth quarter here, about to begin. See Milton Wright trying to move to 2-0. and That three wasn't there. That is a foul call. That is the 15th foul against C. Milton Wright. And two shots coming up here. And like the starters are, at least a couple of them has come back in the game for the Mustangs. First shot. No good. No good. And check out BKD-TV, where Cyber Sports lives. And a foul updates up on there. 
We'll bring you some other articles as well down the road. BKD Dance TV is a website. West Sports Links. Check out the links on each of the videos here. Also have a playlist, of course, coming out once all five games are set. Second shot did not go. And Haunton gets the rebound. He swings it up the court. Inside the layup is good. Jackson puts it in. A timeout. 46-23 game as C. Milton Wright looking to roll, looking to go to 2 and out. I guess the uh, proper song is on uh, the, the help. <laughs> right now, North Carolina has not been able to do much offensively against C. Milton Wright. Tell the team, senior Layton, on the most part, some juniors, they've got a sprinkle of two sophomores and a freshman in there for the Mustangs. As they're trying to win their fourth Hartford County Championship in the last five seasons out there. And you said North Carolina trying to get themselves right it so they can make a repeat run down the con down Concast, get to the uh, 2A state semifinal and final game again. So North Carolina is uh, looking good here and the taste of the second half really really able to expand themselves as we get back to game action. Here here. Double teamed was the Shields briefly. He's able to get it back out. Swinging it back over. Very dangerous passes. They finally get it up the court. Ball goes out of bounds. Uh, I think the referee is saying, yep. North Carolina going to get it back. North Carolina getting the ball back here. Swings it. Count the basket and one. So Wayman shooting the and one. Number 10, Jalen Jackson. Count the bucket. Kendra Wayman at the line. Back on mess. Right away, of course, once again, the IABO Board 23 Challenge. Support of the John Hopkins Children's Center. You can donate to the John Hopkins Children's Center today. And, uh, so here's 704 left. Ball swinging back. Inside, back over. Nice. And what a finish there. Haunting. Giving out all them dimes today. 48 25 game. And Swings it back over. Inside, that one missed. Second chance goes. Nice hustle there by North Carolina. 48-27 game. Swings it back over. Haunting inside. He's going to set up there too much. He pulls it back out. 10 on the shot clock. Back over. Haunting. And a wave off. I think we had a foul off the ball there. So there's a 16 foul against uh, C. Milton Wright. One more and be the one and one. North Carolina is already in the one and one. I mean, he already has gotten C. Milton Wright to the one. Swings it. Back over. Drive inside, second chance. Tried to elevate up, and a jump ball was called. Ball's going to stay with the Bulldogs. Swings it back over, curler. Ooh, made him fall, pull up. Spins in, how about that has changed from Bonds. That was a nice two there. And that cuts the lead to 19, but again, time will not be on the side of uh, North Carolina here today. And a big win, as we see it, look like it's coming for uh, C. Milton Wright. Kicks it back over Haunton. 
Then on the shot clock. Oh, nice dish again. Oh, man, the vision. The vision from Quincy Haunton really looking good right now. And uh, he has turned from in the first half being a scorer to now being a facilitator. And he has really did a good job of it. Pulling inside. No good. Haunton with the rebound. Fast break three on three. Oh, another nice pass. Henske got it in still. And a hard time handling, but he still was able to get the finish. 52-29 game. C. Milton Wright showing why they are ranked, and I wouldn't be surprised if uh, they get into the Baltimore Sun top 15 as well this week after what I've seen here in this one. Inside off the glass in it. And Hall putting a two in. Haunting brings it up. Patterson back to Haunting. Another dish. Skinsky inside and he puts it in again. I'll tell you, everybody getting a piece of that dime today. From Quincy Haunting, the senior. Pick City. Guess who? It was Haunting again. Drive off the glass. Missed it there. Fight for the ball. Brian Sinski gets it back. Haunting. Looking to pass again. He does to Patterson. Patterson kicks it back over to inside and it goes. Bree Hopkins. Bree Hopkins got the two. And it's a 25 point lead right now for C. Milton Wright. They have done it all here in the second half to really establish themselves in this one. And Looking inside Hall again. He's blocked. Then he lost the handle. The ball's going to go back to uh, C. Milton right here. Three twenty-four left. Tried to take it. Patterson cuts inside. Ooh, ball stuck. And it's going to go back to uh, North Carolina. So, North Carolina, uh, as you know, they say it's going to uh, stick and stay with uh, C. Milton Wright. So, North Carolina played in the uh, Bay side, North Division. They'll be looking to get ready for conference play. That three goes from Jalen Jackson. Jalen Jackson. 59-31 and a one that has been controlled. Here by C. Milton Wright, out of bounds, and the ball back. Will stay with uh, the Bulldogs. Swings it back over. Kicks it. That's a three and air ball. So, C. Milton Wright looking to go to 2 0 with 240 left in this one, and uh, they're going to move on. We will see another one of their teams, Aberdeen, coming up against Patterson on the Monday. Here on the Diceman Network taping it, and it will come out to you later on in the week. Second team is in. To see Milton Wright. The Bulldogs. Of North Carolina as they get some of their reserves to come in. So, ladies and gentlemen, it is, in the words of the great Marv Albert, garbage time. But still in this level of play, still good to get guys some action, see what they can do. That's hook shot inside, off the glass, and then how about that from David Ross, a senior? Puts the two home. Pass it over. 
Off the glass, and that's a foul. Jordan Skamski, the freshman, will be coming out to shoot. The two free throws here. First shot here. Front end miss. Second shot coming up here. Right at the two minute mark of this one. Trying to get that 60 up on the board and does. 60-33. 27 point advantage here for the Mustangs of C. Milton Wright. Okay, Charles Milton Wright, actually. That's where the C comes from. And another turnover. Ball back to the Mustangs now. 150 left in this one. Off the screen. Bullets in. Jordan Skanky off the screen. 12 on the shot clock. Back over to Hatfield. The Hatfield. That's a three. That one's spent in and out. Offensive rebound goes. How about that one? How about that one? Hunter Singler there with that two. 29 point lead with 119 left in this one. Back out the timeout. 119 left. Those of you who have uh, stayed with us, we thank you so very much. Back over. Drive. Jumper, got it! How about that? How about that? A nice play there as we're down to seconds left in this one. How about Fidget for three? Back over to Cutcher. He was sandwiched there. Swings it back over. Ten on the shot clock. The glass miss. Second chance goes. It's been that kind of half for C. Milton Wright. Done it all here, and that should do it. So C. Milton Wright come from Hartford County. They're going to go to 2 and 0 here on the season. And North Carolina comes up from the Eastern Shore. Ball's kicked with 3.9 left. They're going to drop to 0 and 2 here on the young year. The defending 2A finalists. Still trying to find themselves and hopefully in a play down there. In the Eastern Shore, they will. That one tipped and missed there. So our final is 64. C. Milton Wright, 36. It's North Carolina. That's our final. Stay tuned for the post game here. Coming up here in a little bit with you here on the Dice Network. Network. Stay tuned now. Back here, our post game. See Milton Wright head coach John. Say it one more time. So Stephanidis. Stephanidis and coach. See Milton Wright, you, you guys look good. I see why you're ranked in the top 20 in the Frosty Sports Net Polar Star of the Year. Um, they're playing well right now. Uh, we, the snow hurt us a little bit, but coming in, the kids are working really hard. Um, they're worried about execution and they're willing to share the ball. All things that are quality things that are going to help us where we need to go. I tell you, man, looking at. Uh, Haunted number two. Quincy looked very good. He was a scorer in the first half, facilitating the second. 
How you like his game come to his senior year? Um, Quincy's one of those guys that he actually played in the uh, state uh, championship games down there as a freshman. So he has this drive since then of being a champion himself, and he doesn't want this team to lose. He's going to put them on the back. He'll do what's necessary, and that's the perfect leader that we need in our school. No question about it. And uh, you guys getting in the Hartford County play out there and the UB AC conference, and we'll be seeing Aberdeen Monday. Tell us a little bit more about the conference and what you expect out of it since you guys trying to get that fourth title in five years. Um, we are. Uh, it's, it's a tough conference. Uh, we, we have Patterson Mill, the Jared Clark, the head coach there. He's got the team in the Final Four two of the last four years. Hartford Tech's been in the Final Four. Have the Graces. Just They picked up Marlon Lewis. They look really good, too. Um, it's going to be a battle every night. Uh, I know we don't get a lot of credit up our way for how good the teams really are, but they're good. And if we don't come to play, we're going to go come home with some losses. No question about it. Well, Coach, congratulations on Thank a win today. Two and zero start, and we hope to see you guys down the road. Oh, we thanks hope again. To see you too. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. And as we come back with the post game here, C. Milton Wright going up to two and zero. Here, Coach John, there. The UC BAC, very difficult conference in Hartford County, and Mr. Lewis, we checked him out, and the. Super 80 showcase in the summertime. So, North Carolina, the defending 2A finalists, will try to find themselves at 0 and 2 out in the Eastern Shore. Coming up next, Mervo Calvert Hall here on the Die Sony Network. You stay tuned for that one. That one should be an interesting one as well. For my man AJ, I'm DeMars Die. We'll see you coming up. This is Die Sporting Network.